I'm here at um, Olive Garden for their never-ending pasta because uh, that's the best deal. If you want to like eat, eat out, then boom, that. So that's that'll be the exciting thing of the day. And then also, uh, I went to Goodwill and I got a book for two bucks. Empire. And then this is the story of uh, Quana Parker and then the Comanche, which I'm really interested in. I thought it was like the, the Sioux, the Arapaho, you know, the other things, the Mohicans and all the things that I, I learned. But no, the most powerful tribe in the Native American nation um, were the Comanches. So I got this for two bucks. I'm also reading this about like modern uh, Native Americans in cities. But I got this at full price for like 16 bucks, so I won't be doing that again. But at the time, I had like some extra money, so I bought this in support of the author. But now I just want to like read, so cheap. Maybe I can like do this in the library, but I don't, I don't want to do the library stuff because I might like write things in here and stuff. So yeah, so good reading. Reading is still the best. I, can, I mean, like I pretty much have an idea of what the story of Quana Parker is, you know, like little girl, a Caucasian girl abducted during the raids and stuff, and then raised by the Native Americans, got got a kid with the Native Americans, and then that's Quana Parker. So that, that'll be an exciting story. In the meantime, bread. Now, first round arrived. The, Supa Toscana. This is often what I just order here because I've had the other ones, you know, the other soups, uh, minestrone and stuff, the traditional ones. Maybe when my next round I'll go for minestrone, but I love this soup. Now, I noticed over the years they, they got rid of the green stuff that they put with the soup. So maybe like the fresh vegetables a little too much and um, expensive or something. So, or maybe they don't give that when it's like unlimited supply. I don't know, but this is delicious. Mm. Thank you. Butter for the bread. <laughs> this is a technique. Butter in with the warm bread. See? Right there. Wrap that let the butter melt a little bit so so my pasta arrived angel hair pasta with uh, meatballs and I mixed the, the mushroom white sauce with their marinara to make it look pink just just to make it different the, this the closest thing I can get to Italy because the real Italian, if you go to like an Italian place, it's really like super duper expensive and I can't afford it. So Olive Garden, when they're on sale <laughs> or when they're giving the discount. So it's awesome that way. It's good? Yeah. Let's try the first bite. Of the sauce, the mushroom sauce with uh, marinara and angel hair pasta. This is a technique with pasta. The, the spoon and then the fork. And then you twirl. And against the fork. Or against the bowl. Instead of a plate bowl. See, this is like a plate bowl. So you can do that in the side, like in the wall. You twist it there, like that. And also you listen to Dean Martin, to Dino, <laughs> while you eat pasta. <laughs> well, I love you. Buonasera, signorina. Cosmic good night. Mm. Let me finish the soup first, though. Mm. 
one meatball and the pasta and I'm about to tap out. I'll go one more round and then and one of the good things about like dishes with sauces is this. When you break bread and scrape the sauce. <laughs> Get out the sauce! <laughs> That's the best. <laughs> mm. no. Get off the sauce! <laughs> and I'm ordered uh, the next round, which is a spaghetti. It's a smaller portion, a smaller bowl. It's a spaghetti with a meat sauce mixed with the creamy mushroom to make it like pink. Make it all like dynamic, exciting. And Italian sausage of the three choices. And then I think for this next round, I, I tap out. Six. Too much carbs. Get off the sauce. <laughs> it's good, but it's a lot. I'll finish the, the last round and I surrender. <laughs> Advertising. <laughs> so for my next pasta, I ordered um, spaghetti, but they gave me fettuccine, but it's still the same thing. It's just like flat and wider. And then the, uh, the meat sauce and then the mushroom white sauce with Italian, Italian sausage. So that's good. Yeah. One round, I'm, I'm done. <laughs> I don't eat much anymore. I used to like five rounds of pasta with bread and salad and three rounds of soup. Or oh, maybe, maybe I'll get soup. Maybe that will set me up. I'm, I surrender. It's hard. <laughs> it's a struggle. But my last dish, three dishes, would be the soup, the chicken gnocchi, Italian gnocchi or something. Because um, for the the this promotion, you you start with never any soup or salad and breadsticks so breadstick soup or salad so i chose the soup so i'm gonna try the other soup what soup the chicken and gnocchi that's the that's my last or next plate see the difference between the spaghetti or like longer thinner noodles is the fettuccine it's hard to twirl they'll slip out so that's why i like the angel hair or the spaghetti because you can twirl them easier than fettuccine or the ones that you stab the, the regatonis you stab those things I know it's it's a preference thing. Maybe you're getting the same amount, <laughs> but I like to to twirl the pasta, like you know, twirl, twirl, twirl. But like the fettuccine, it will slip out because they're they're flat. See, there. Noodles don't do that. Like the round noodles, they don't do that. So you can. I can twirl my noodles, which I like to do. Like that. But they don't have chopsticks here. Because you can pinch the, the food. I surrender. <laughs>